Bro, the music in these games are god tier. They're so fucking good. Gather round, all of you who would listen. I have a tale to tell. A story of warriors and kings. A saga of dark magic. A legend of high adventure. Long ago, a series of dark spells were created with the power to enslave our world. Evil magic with no purpose but that of destruction. But before these spells could be invoked, they were stolen and broken apart. Dark and powerful. These words were not easily destroyed, and so were hidden about the world, branded onto the souls of innocence, cursing their lines for eternity. Men are mortal, and time can be the enemy of fear. All too soon we forget how the bee will sting and the fire will burn. As time passed, these families forgot what the marks were for, dismissing the ancient warnings about these words of power. They were merely stories, tales from a long past time. But an evil sect, known only as the Kasai, knew nothing of time, and with infinite patience they waited until their spells were rediscovered. were filled with the greatest and most honorable warriors who gave up everything for the cause of defending those marked. Many legends tell of the bravery of the Rakus and of their eternal struggle with the Kasai. Like these stories, mine begins long ago. But unlike any other that I know of, it also begins with the hero's death. I remember it all as if it were a dream. I, Kuzo, scout and chronicler to the great Rao Utu, flying over a white landscape through snow-filled skies, being drawn by a voice calling my name.
Fuha! Uzo, it is I, Oracle to the Three Kingdoms, and I am in need of your service. Spirit Guide, something has happened that neither the gods nor I could foresee. Your master, Ra'utu, is dead. His death is unexpected, and has thrown the heavens into chaos. The gods are calling on you, Spirit Guide, to visit the past, and relive critical periods that led up to his death. We do not know when or how this happened, Kuzo. All we know is that Rao was betrayed. We were betrayed. Three destinies are intertwined with Rao's Kuzo. His sister Tati, and the Rakus warriors, Bamusu and Grizz. Travel with them all once more, rewalk their paths, and discover what has happened. All I know is that it will end in a decision that shapes the future of mankind. Let us travel back to when Bamusu and Grizz were mighty warriors fighting for the Rakus. Let us travel twenty years into your past. Back to Tapu Roku and the pursuit of a traitor. Many years before I served Rao, I traveled the land in the charge of Baumusu, the great and noble warrior. I remember journeying with him and his mentor Grizz on urgent Rakus business. We were to hunt down a fugitive to Rakus turned traitor called Maybisi before he located the final parts to the Mark of Kree.
As soon as we landed on the shores of Tapuroku, we knew something was amiss. We had been warned that Maybisi had wealth and could hire mercenaries, but these men were no bought swords. They fought with too much passion, too much hatred. Only upon closer inspection did Grizz discover their real identity. They were outlawed members of an ancient cult known only as the Kasai.
What the hell is wrong with the AI here, man? It's like they're totally unconcerned with my existence.
Maybe she was a Turakus who had been dabbling in forbidden Kasai lore. He had discovered the whereabouts of the Mark of Kree and was attempting to retrieve its parts. It seems strange to me now that nobody considered the Kasai a threat back then. They were all but wiped out, an old enemy long forgotten. But the Kasai had found one of the two remaining Marks in Tapuroku, and now their attention shifted to the final Mark. Fucking teammate shit. This is fucking dumb. I don't like that. Makes things so much easier. Like, is there a way to get this this fucker out of here? Like, I hate this.
That's so shitty. That's so bold, man. That is very unfortunate. Oh, this review of this game. Very unfortunate right now. Uh, it's so fucking disappointing. Because the game looks fucking sick. Look at this fucking idiot. Come from, dude. Yeah. 
Okay, well, whatever. where we just came from. Why is there another a horn sentry? Silently killing a sentry can prevent other enemies from being heard and give you the advantage on oh, okay. Fuck oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Such a sick execution. Come on. Go ahead. Come on. You fucking idiot. Come on. There we go. Ooh. Alright, it wasn't that flashy. Still cool though. Sounds like he's having an orgasm when he's getting the fucking shit. <sighs> what an actual- I fucking hate this AI. Fucking hate it, actually. I 
know how to do that. Man. What the fuck? Like... <sighs> this is unfortunately bugging the fuck out of me. That's it. I need to find all the fucking cuckoos. This is the fifth part, Rakus. Now I only need the child to complete the spell. We will die before we let that happen. Traitor. You cannot stop me, Rakus. I already know her location. It's too late. No one can protect her. Kasai. I can smell their teeth on you from here. Fool, Rakus. Kneel before me. Who bear witness to my power? I mean, I guess. Let's 
Why are you telling me this again? I've already, I've been doing it. That's it. Okay. No actual boss. They. I think I was not a boss. I remember that the Kasai are not what they are now. Back then they were all but destroyed, yet there had been many of them that told them. And may be commended them like a general. And what of the strange beast conjured from the ground? It had been eons since anyone had possessed such magic. Had may be studied enough of their black arts to command such creatures? Now may be had all of the parts to the mark of Kree save one. A mark that was on the back of a defenseless infant. We had many questions that needed to be answered. And so you returned from the first path, spirit guide, from twenty years in the past. Back then, the Lakus were naive to Mabisi's treachery, and had no idea where it would lead. Bamusu and Grizz left for Vaitaku in search of answers, but we will return to their part in this story later. Spirit guide, let us now leap forward in time twenty years to the next path we wish to walk. Back when Rao and his sister Tati were seeking information about the mark on her back. They wanted to learn more about the ancient spell that Tati bore. And about the nightmares that plagued her. That is how they came to the city of Nungari. And to me. So the Oracle's attention shifted to Tati, Rao's sister, now twenty-one and bitter at the world, cursed with a line from The Mark of Kree. Filled with anger and hatred for the Kasai, she walked a knife edge between good and evil as she sought to destroy those who had killed her family. Rao and Tati were searching for a tree that was an Oracle. I remember him instructing her to be stealthful as we arrived at the outskirts of the city. Nangari was a dangerous place, and so they should split up. He would take to the roofs, while she, the streets. Yes, please. Please don't give me this bullshit of two players. Like, I don't need that. I do not need that. Thank you. Please fuck off. Oh, okay, interesting.
Start the level. Wow. Didn't even let me fucking do the thing. Are you fucking serious right now? character's fucking body is arching too far forward so that when I do the stealth kill it just fucking does nothing. That was sick. That was fucking sick. What else? Not see that, my guy. Oh, that's not as painful. That's cool. Uh, there's nothing else here. Man's What the fuck? What is going on with this camera? Okay. Jesus. What the fuck, man? There. Fucking die, you dummy. Okay. 
What the fuck? I didn't. Okay. What? What the fuck is this? What just happened to my fucking body? What the fuck is this? Oh! How did that happen? I don't... Oh, okay? Okay. I mean, that was really cool, but like, I don't- I want to know how that worked. Do I just become more stealthy if I don't move for like a period of time? I don't know. I guess so. That's pretty OP, actually. Actually, fighting up there. Why the fuck? What the fuck? Seriously? This is so fucking unfair. No. I didn't do anything. See that there before? Fuck. I almost feel like going back for that. No, it's not worth it. It's fine. This game isn't even hard. I can just go through this shit, no problem. <sighs> Years before, when Rao Rao was young, young in search of adventure, he had sought, he had sought information, information from an old invite. There he there ate, he her, ate fruit. her fruit. And, and... What? I didn't skip anything! The cutscene was broken! Come on, man! Seriously? This game is disappointing me right now. This game is disappointing me. I don't like it. Still for a few moments, with concentration you can cloud the minds of the living and seem to disappear. That is pretty cool. 
Oh, I want that. I like her voice actor. It's a cool ability, but it's just a little broken. I hope there's a way to offset it from being so good. No, 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 no. You fucking bitch. Come on. Do it. Fuck you. Bitch. Come on. Oh my god. Just gonna spam this. Yep, there you go. What are the level challenges? Discover and use a story shrine. What? How is that? Problem is, wait for Ra to kill the two guards above, avoid getting spotted. Okay, okay, well, that's kind of cool. my thing. Come on, man. Kill him already. There we go. Yup. Get his bitch ass. I'm gonna get this guy. There you go. Oh. Oh. Nothing there. Ah, oh, I lied. Okay. This is fucking awesome. Great. Great. No. I just alerted like every enemy. Fucking damn it.
Much bigger area, okay. Combat scenarios. When you approach a combat scenario, it is always best to use scout ahead. Yeah, 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 whatever. I mean, like, yeah. <sighs> whatever, man. I need to get up here somehow. Cannot be seen by him. Cannot be seen by him either. Oh, okay, so I need to go this way. Oh! Like, where was I supposed to go? Oh, come on, dude. What the fuck? The stealth just feels so fucking shit in this game. Come on. Let's go. Where he's at. 
Привет. Oh my god, her executions are fucking sick though, I'll give him that, I'll give him that. Okay. There is nothing to see here, man. Absolutely nothing to see. There's a guy right there. Uh, okay. Am I looking in the wrong place right now? Nope, he's right there. That just looks so wrong. The way that was executed. Is this the fucking beginning? No, 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 no. I ain't come from here. I ain't come from here. It's over here. Ooh, that's... Okay. No enemies. When the monitor was... Dude! Where's the voice? You were just talking! God, I don't even care anymore. Like, how fucking stupid is that? 
That's so stupid, man. This is really pissing me off. Like, what the fuck? Okay, I'm not gonna be walking like this. I need to fucking go faster. I do this. As a child, remembers his tutor Baumusu, speaking of the oracle and its importance to the three kingdoms. He also remembers a second tree being planted should the first ever be destroyed. This second tree was in Nungari, a Kasai city. To sneak into a Kasai stronghold like Nungari was foolish, but Rao sought advice from the oracle. He needed information about the strange skills that Tati was developing and the nightmares that plagued him. Not the nightmares. Yeah, that is where I am. Okay, we got quite a few enemies here. We got one there, one there. Two over there. That's not that's not too bad. Actually. Just gotta wait for this guy. Oh wait no. Yeah, gotta wait for that guy. They're moving together. Man, 
maybe I can move in now. If I move in now. What is this room? What the fuck is this? Who's in here? Ah. Look down. He's all the way over there. He's in here. Bro, how are you seeing me? This stealth system is pissing me off. This is fucking pissing me off. in this game is so fucking broken, man. So fucking dumb. I actually hate it. Just die, man. I like how that move just misses, like, all the time. Like, why? Why? Uh, this is so fucking dumb, man. I fucking hate this. This is so fucking stupid. How on earth did you see me? You're underneath the fucking shit and you see me. Fuck you. Fuck you. Bullshit. What a fucking disappointment, man. This is so fucking dumb. What a disappointment. How? Okay. This game is pissing me off, man. What a terrible fucking spot to put that shit. Oh my god. I don't even want to continue playing. The stealth in this game is so fucking broken beyond belief, it's actually retarded. Even when I'm by myself. Wow. Well, can I go onto the wall, please? Fucking bullshit. Bullshit, man.
game fucking is a disaster. What the fuck was that?
Upon communing with the Oracle, she told him that Rao was one of the last of the Rakus, an ancient order of warrior knights charged with watching over those marked with the spells. Then she warned Tati to beware the temptation that came with her curse, for the mark was evil and would seek to manipulate her. She instructed them in their destiny, preordained by the gods. You should travel the land, seeking out those cursed with the mark, and ensure that they are protected. Some will be ancient scrolls hidden away, while others will be innocents, marked and oblivious to their importance. She also warned them to make haste in their quest. They were not the only ones with interest in these words of power. Someone else was collecting the spells. Someone was amassing a library of evil. <laughs> 